you know, look at that whole house I was talking about earlier in the video. And I'm saying earlier in the video, but most likely, I'm gonna put this at the beginning. Look at the whole separate garage I was talking about. And if y'all wondering, what the heck Gil talking about? Y'all gonna have to watch the video and see. I talked about it. Hey, out here sweating, baby. Let's go, go, gadget, get him. Flavor. This hill, this one section, I did it before Thanksgiving. I went down and back. It took me about 40 minutes to go all the way to the end, and then I came back. This is going to be my butter. This is my first time doing it since then. And this time, I'm not going to do down and back. I'm just going down and then go home because I've already been walking over an hour. I told y'all this one going to be a two hour. Well, you got to watch the video because this going to be in the beginning also with the house video. Welcome to the Big Gill Show. Welcome to Big Gill Show. This is Michael Gill Crash Show. Welcome back to Big Gill's YouTube channel. Welcome back to Big Gill YouTube channel. What up? Wow. I can't believe I'm this loud. At 5 30 in the morning. I'm tripping. I hope my neighbors. Don't wake up out there sleep like, what the heck was that? <laughs> what up, y'all? Out here getting it in. Oh, boy. Typical North Carolina weather. Yesterday I went from thinking I needed to wear more to the day. And apparently for about the next six or seven days, I might be in short sleeves. Yes, we go from dang near freezing yesterday, where well, it was below 29 degrees when I was out walking, to this morning about 50. High, we'll be in the 60s and 70s for the next six, seven days. So far, I only look at seven day forecasts. So, it's spring again. Everybody know it's spring again to the boys and girls and we all love. This is the time to fall in love. Excuse me. Huh? All right. So I'm out walking the neighborhood. Figured I'd do this instead of um, going to a parking lot. I mean, in years past, before YouTube, this is what I did. I always walked the neighborhood. But I changed it up a little bit. I don't know why. I think I do. Now that I think about it, I think I was like, like now. Fire department is across the street from my house. And firemen just came to the door. I guess just to check the weather or whatever. And I'm talking to y'all. And it just blasted through me when I said, I don't know why. And I seen him. It hit me. That's why you don't want your neighbors to think you're crazy. <laughs> I don't care how many times I say, you know, they can think I'm video chatting with somebody. I still, I guess because I'm older, I'm new to this. Well, I just came up a hill. That's why I'm breathing heavier. Y'all know I love hills. But I guess because I'm older, I'm new to this. I'm not used to all this video chatting and all that. I still trip when people have stuff in their ears. And they be talking. And I be like, huh? What you say? 
and they point to their ear. And I'll be like, oh, I still do that. Most other people in the office get it. They laugh at me. They say, you still fall for that? They done got to the point where they don't address somebody unless they say their name, which I guess I should start doing. I'm just used to somebody like me right now walking down the street talking. I'm sitting on the porch like, that man hunted crazy. Look at that fool. Look at that crazy dude. Who he talking to? <laughs> I guess that's how I still am. <sighs> All right. I'm out here getting it in. It's Big Gil. He bought the wall. It's Big Gil. He gonna talk. It's Big Gil. <laughs> Oh, I kind of miss this area. This is the country. This is Main Street. In my little city. This is crazy. Train track right here. Boy, me and my wife almost turned down this house because we was like, how loud is that train going to be? Now we're used to it. But it does come through. Four, five in the morning. House vibrate a little bit. I feel for these people that stay right here across from it. At least we're back there and up the street a little bit. But these folks, it's right here. But you deal with it. All right, out here sweating. Oh, boy, I tell you. It's hard, but it is fair. Somebody got to do it. Might as well be us. Excuse me. Ooh. We gotta get out here and sweat. Well, the weight's coming down. What? Four days, three days. It's been three days. I'm down eight. I ain't really showing no weight. I guess I could, but this is, um, I ain't really doing nothing special. Just walking. I'm eating. <laughs> it ain't water fasting. <sighs> but just back out doing what I do. Walking, talking. Oh. I did cut out um, everything but water. Well, no, I got them electrolytes I used to drink when I was water fasting. I did put that in a two liter bottle yesterday. Just to mix it up. And it really won't for that. I thought about that after I did it. It was because I said, I'm walking. Let me get some electrolytes in me. Plus, I had it sitting around. I bought it. I might as well use it. <sighs> oh, you know it's been a while. They done built the new house. Yeah. Well, y'all can see it a little bit. Yeah, it is lit up. That used to be an empty lot. Last year. Now it's a whole house with a garage that's separated from the house. <laughs> that's nice. Wow, they were building a recreation center up here. Last time I went walking past here, it was a bunch of dirt and they had started building it because it was the, the um, blocks in the ground. You know, riding by, I see they finished. It ain't open yet, but they finished it, so. And you know, time moves on. Just cause you disappear for a minute, that don't stop nothing. They got a for sale sign and everything up over there. A whole house. Wow. <laughs> uh, I don't know why, well, I probably won't be videoing by then. Cause I was gonna say about 
45 minutes, I'll be walking by there. Because that's what I do. I walk all the way down Main Street, cross over, and then walk down there. <sighs> y'all remember them hills I showed y'all before Thanksgiving? That's where I'm going to end up. That's going to be my last hurrah. Because I walk 30 minutes Monday, about 45, 40 minutes Tuesday, 45 minutes. No, no. I did over an hour yesterday, hour and 15 minutes. Today going to be about two hours. I was kind of mad at myself because I it got out of shape. I said it in the video, it didn't take long. That, um, because I hadn't done it. They got a whole train over here. I guess a car. Because it ain't a train. I don't know if y'all can see that. It's a whole train. I wonder what they're doing. They go, I guess, the, the wheels from it, the tracks. Wow. Just sitting over here in an empty field. <laughs> Ain't no telling. They gonna do something. Something historic in Raleigh. Yeah, cause they got a Porter John out here. So they doing something. Either they going on um, tour something or they building something. House and building movers house lifting and moving yeah they got a concrete pad there so they are they gonna put the house there but if so why they got that caboose there that that tra that rail car railroad train whatever <laughs> oh but anyway <laughs> something not happened to me that usually don't I forgot what I was talking about. Hmm. That's interesting. Let me find out and I'll get back to y'all. Mama said there'd be days like this. Boy, y'all, y'all young people, listen to y'all parents and y'all elders, the older folks, the ones with experience. Because the stuff they say, man, it be coming to pass. Some of it. Don't listen to all that negativity. Now, they trying to help you listen. Well, they're trying to warn you. Because I literally forgot what I was talking about. I had to look at the video, y'all, and see what I was talking about. Oh, y'all see the steam? Y'all see the steam? There it go. I told y'all. So let me guess. It didn't happen when it was real cold. But now it's happening that it's not as cold. So maybe the temperature gotta be at certain degrees. Cause it ain't 20 something. It might be 45, 50 something, I don't know. It ain't too cold. And the wind ain't blowing. But yeah, they got the steam. You can't see it now. There you go. <laughs> Gil heating up. Here go the recreation center, y'all. Like I said, oh, it's an indoor track. It's basketball courts, and it's a track around the top that I can see from out here. And this is new. This is good. Get the kids something to do. Get out the house. Stop playing all those video games. Come play some basketball. I'm pretty sure, like, when I was a kid, they probably got bumper pool, pool, ping pong. And it's a um, city of Raleigh, so it ain't, um, you ain't got to pay no membership like the YMCA. Just come and play. Oh, like I said, last time I walked down here, about the beginning of March, April of 2019. It was just bricks. Way back then, they had a fence around here. Cause the street didn't come back this far. You can see where it stopped. That's where the sidewalk used to be right there. And I used to walk the street 
I said, I can't wait till they get this thing done. Especially when I seen it was going to be an indoor track. When it rained, Big Gil got somewhere to go. I come walk around the court. <laughs> Just walk in the oval. But anyway, what I was talking about, see, I ain't forget this time, was um how I hadn't walked in about two or three weeks. And when I got back out there, I was, woo! Man, I, 30 minutes, I was done. Which I've been doing this stuff so long, lifting weights and all kinds of stuff. I know about muscle memory and all that, so I knew it would be back. I said, I think in one of my videos, if y'all looked at it, that it would be a week or so. Hey, it's been three days. Now I'm back. Oh, yesterday I only stopped because I had to do something. I got about an hour and 15 minutes in. And I had an appointment, so I had to get home, drag the rag, and get to doing business. This is nice, man. All this, it used to be a house right here and a church. The church was actually right there, and it was a house right here. And the rest of this was woods. Cause you used to see so many deer, wildlife. I used to walk by here sometimes cause the house was abandoned. You know, it was just an old house. And I used to be like, boy, sometimes I would get in the street. Cause I said, what if a bear or something grabbed you? Cause it was just woods, woods everywhere. Now it's a whole gym, parking lot, connect to the highway back there. Mm. God is good. Awesome. Technology. Now, I see how, you know, I told y'all I'm led by the Holy Spirit. So when I said it, it hit me inside. Some people could say they should have left the trees. I'm one of them people. I think it's too much building going on. Because I'm like, hey, man, don't we need these trees? It's green light for oxygen. If y'all keep tearing down stuff and building, why in the world we gonna breathe? Y'all, are y'all thinking about that? Cause I tell you, especially living down here in North Carolina, coming from being born in Pennsylvania, lived in Pennsylvania, visit all the time. There's no trees, it's amazing. The little stuff, when my family come and visit, they literally take out their cameras, their phones, and video us driving down the highway. And I'm like, what's so amazing about driving down the highway? We got green. Up there is literally a concrete jungle. We have trees. We have, in the middle of the highway, flowers from hundreds of miles. They don't have that, and they don't. It's just concrete, brick, everywhere. Huh? The rate that all y'all are moving down here, I say y'all, us, because I'm a Yankee too. It's going to be like that soon, because we are, gro good gracious, North Carolina, the Triangle, Research Triangle Park, RTP. There's a reason we always in the top five of places to live in America. People love it down here. And it's cheaper compared to up north, out west. Oh, man, stuff y'all buy a shack with, rent with, you can come down here and buy a mansion. It's wonderful. They're doing up. Little Main Street, that's gonna be a club. It used to be a florist. Now what they did was remove the stuff that was up there. I think it was stucco or whatever. And that stuff was down there. Hazels, you could buy Coca-Cola for five cent. You know, that stuff that was here way back. 
Now it's a little bar, a little says private club, Shady's. Coca-Cola, five cent. Whatever Hazel's was. <laughs> That's amazing when they were doing construction. And like I said, I was walking. This is my route. I walked for years and I seen it. I was like, that's some historic stuff right there. Behind that thing that was there. That floor has been here 35, 40 years. Behind it was this all this time. <sighs> Amazing. Just stuff you see. <sighs> all right. That's enough, y'all. Y'all know the deal. Get out here and sweat. Let's work out. Get this weight off of us. I lost 100 pounds last year. I want to do more than that this year. That's all. Ain't no resolution. Just a, just a goal. What the Lord said. Get your vision. Write it down. Make it plain. I wrote it in my heart. And I'm making it plain to you all. Lose more than I lost last year. Healthily. Now, I know that's not a word. But it's a gillism. I like it. <laughs> Let's do it healthily. <laughs> I don't want to be sick and lose no 100 plus pounds. Let's work out. Get it in. Sweat. <sighs> I never mind sweating. It's actually... For me, a bonus, I enjoy it. It lets me know I'm getting it in. Cause in about a month or so, y'all, y'all seen it before. I'm gonna be out here walking two or three hours and be like, dang, did I do anything? My shirt got a little drip on it. But that's why I use the scale. Some people don't, I do it daily. If you ain't putting it in, don't do it, because it'll frustrate you. But if you're putting it in, I do it. Because if I don't sweat, I feel like I ain't worked out hard enough. But I get on that scale and it'll show me. Yes, you did. Pounds coming off. That's all that matters. Pounds coming off. What they call it, non-scale victories. You'll see that through clothes. Stuff you couldn't do that you can't do. Like what, about a month ago? Yeah, about two weeks ago. Y'all remember I was at the, I rode the city bus for the first time in 30 years. 30 plus years. And I was able to sit in them seats I thought I couldn't sit in at the bus stop. Non-scale victories. So that stuff will happen. But anyway, let's get out here and get it in, y'all. Work out, sweat, eat right. I'm eating better. I ain't eating perfectly right, but it's better. Hey, weight's coming off. Like I said, I got that appointment in a month and a half. Make sure this blood pressure come down. I might check it myself. But that feels like cheating. Yeah, I think I'm just going to get it in. I just wait till I go to the doctor. Amen. All right. By the power of Christ Jesus, death, burial, and resurrection, I thank you all and I love you all. And I pray y'all get out here and sweat and get healthy, get happy, stay happy, right? Because we already happy. Amen. <laughs> I don't know how well y'all can see these hills. But this the hills I was talking about. It's like a roller coaster ride. See the car going up, it went down, it's going up. It's about to go down again. And then behind it, it comes up another big hill. And then on top of there, you go down and around. Y'all see it? Y'all see the car? It's like a roller coaster ride. Yeah. It's my brother right here. Now be truthful. This hill ain't got nothing on the roller coaster ride I just took. <sighs> and years ago, this is how I used to finish all my workouts. 
But mind you, I was already in shape. I was already walking five hours a day, three hours a day, and I would come here to go back home. I always said to get back to the house, I was gonna walk up this hill. Whew. I have never done it. Like I said, I just discovered the roller coaster rides. Well, I think I did it years ago, I'm not sure. No, because I remember those. So yeah, I just discovered them before Thanksgiving. I'm spent. I gotta walk up this hill. But hey, we're gonna do it, even if we gotta do it backwards. No, I ain't doing it backwards. All right, y'all. I'll see y'all on tomorrow's video. <sighs> Big dog tired. I don't want to say next week. It might be next week or no later than two weeks from now. I'm going to be doing this like, dun, 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 dun. but not today. <laughs> All right, y'all. Let's get sweating. Later. <sighs> I love it. Welcome to the Big Gill Show. Welcome to Big Gill Show. This is Michael Gilchrist Show. Holla back at the Big Gill Show.